welcome back folks so i thought like i would just uh, talk with selen and get her sorceries off screen and then go back to the dungeon but when i came to here i saw that like uh, she has some extra dialogues to tell us so i thought i better get that captured in the video you wish to continue the lesson very well i have time a plenty so this was about glinton glinstone sorcery Let's uh, hear more about it. Or maybe I'm delusional. I already asked about it and I'm checking it again, out again. But anyhow, whatever it is, I want to make sure that this is recorded. So about Glinstone sorcery. Our Let's hear it out. Our upon the powers embedded in Glinstone. But what is the nature of such power? Glinstone is the amber of the cosmos. Golden amber contains the remnants of ancient life and houses its vitality, while Glinstone contains residual life, and thus the vitality of the stars. It should not be forgotten that Glinstone's sorcery is the study of the stars and the life therein, a fact lost on most sorcerers these days. All right, so this is definitely not an uh, old dialogue. This was a new dialogue that I could have gotten out of Salon. So that's great. Maybe we are progressing Selen's quest line. So let's see what we can study from Selen. So we have Crystal Barrage. I don't need that. Glinstone Arc. I already have that. Glinstone Shard. Glenstone Pebble, I don't need that. A crystal Barrage, I don't need that as well. So what the hell, like, she can teach me. Carrion Slicer. Well, I guess I'll take that. Yeah, I'll purchase that. And I'll also purchase this. Great. Uh, larger magic projectiles from Glenstones. Yeah, let's buy this. Let's buy this. So I will be able to buy four more shit from her. That's great. For learning is impressive. You make me proud to have grown little legs so readily. You must have a fabulous teacher. You wish yeah. to continue very well. Well, I thought like she would be having a new dialogue or something, but definitely not. But let's just attune some spells because I got some good spells that I can attune so level up no memory spell so the first one that I want to get rid of is this one obviously and use the guardian slicer one of the sorcerers of the carrion royal family conjures a magic sword and delivers a swift sweeping slash this sorcery can be used uh, this sorcery can be used without delay after performing another action okay this is uh, one of the effective uh, sorceries I see that's great No, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do this. I also wanted to do this. And I wanted to swift, uh, swift glinstone shard. So FP cost is only 5, okay, great, great glinstone shard, it cost 12, uh, 
Okay, let's check this out. Guardian Slicer, that's great. What else did I want to try out? Uh, Rona Crawl, no, not that one. Crucible Horns, no. Flame Sound Frenzy, no. Is there anything else that I would like to try out? No, there is nothing else that I would like to try out. So what we have is good shit. So great, I'm sure. Guardian Splicer. Okay, that's really nice. This is going to be fun. The Guardian Splicer. Oh, I forgot. I should uh, change up the items to see if I can use let's say I wanted to swap this for the Uchi Gatana where are you Uchi if I can enchant the Uchi Gatana then I think I'll be upgrading the Uchi Gatana Only and only if I can. Oh fuck. I fucked myself over. I didn't want to do that. at it I can do I'll be using the Uchi Katana. So I'll put some more points into decks and I'll definitely be using this. This is a very good weapon, but right now I'm fat rolling, it's okay. Don't care. This sword is crazy stylish. I can do this, that's nice. The Samurai Slash. Cool. But I look really silly with this like red hood. It doesn't go with my fashion. You know what? Fashion is more important than getting a little bit of health. What if I wear this? How do I look? Does my guy look cool? Yeah, he looks damn cool, if you ask me. Yeah. Let's say I get this.
Cool, man. This is going to be excellent. I just need to get like few more stats into decks. Four more levels into decks. And I'll be using the Uchigatana very soon. Alright, I'm quite excited now to be able to use the Uchigatana. So, uh, let's go back. Let's change that. I don't need it. I don't need this. I don't need this as well. Where is that? Here. And over here, I'll use the bow. Where is longbow? Master longbow. Longbow plus four. All right. We are back with our previous setup. Am I missing something? I don't think so. I have what I need. Yeah, the only thing left doing is readjusting what I need to adjust. So for now, I don't need any. I will keep the great glenstone shard. I will remove this, I don't need that, don't need that, I'll keep that, and then I will keep glinstone, glinstone pebble, as magic projectiles from glinstones, I guess I'll take this, and no, I don't need this. I just need this glinstone arc and carrion slicer. Where is carrion slicer? Yeah, that's what I need. I'm good to go. Okay, so just need to check one more thing. I know I'm doing a lot of like weapon management in the video recording. It might be a little boring for some of us, but you have to understand that I'm really excited now and psyched. I see that I'm ma making some meaningful upgrades into my character. So my progression further, so it's going to be more easier. So that's why I'm just uh, doing it all in once. Yeah, maybe I could do this offline, but anyway, too much time is spent now. Uh, we'll uh, try to do it next time. So the only thing that I wanted to check is... 12, 20... 10... 4... Okay. Let's see. So it's better to use glinstone arc rather than the great glinstone thingy that I have there. So that's all good. Now let's head out. So now we want to go to this area, this dungeon that we did not complete last time because we were under leveled. But this time we're going to rock it and get some more sweet loots. Let's see our guy. He looks nice. Oh, I don't have any stone sword key. Fuck. Maybe I'll be able to get one while I'm here. So this is the boss gate, obviously. Yeah, I'm 
definitely properly leveled now to face this guy. I forgot to kill you. Human bone shard. Human bone shard. I wonder what does that what that does. Human bone shard. Is that like some sort of crafting item? I hear someone. A fish paid a little bit more attention I would not need to search for it now yeah human bone shard it's a ingredient glove word that's great so we came from here Another head. Liar. Who is liar and who is truth bearer? Or like, who is telling the truth? How would I know? It says tunnel ahead, but there is no tunnel. So I guess the second guy here is. Do I hear sound? As if it's coming from the back? Double tap! Why I see Oh shit
I thought the fire is also under level, so it will not do too much damage to me. So I thought of like, I can run out, nothing will happen to me. But definitely I was wrong. Human bone shard, five of them, that's nice. Nice, nice, nice. So let's go in and check out what we have here. Wow, there's so many blood stains. Gold rooms. by the hidden path so there is some sort of hidden path ahead It shit you skeleton motherfucker. Liar ahead. No. Maybe here? No. Lever ahead. Okay. A heavy door has opened somewhere. I will check out the heavy door later on. I want to check out what's... That really seemed like a fake wall, but definitely. Oh, this is where I came from. How silly I am. This is where I came from. I should go this way and check out what's here. Oh, there is a grave ward.
Oh fuck. They're overwhelming me now. Okay, fuck. They got me overwhelmed. Wow, that was a good trap. Like, put four skeletons together and they could be a menace. I was almost about to be dead there. But anyhow, I recovered. Thank you. Alright, but uh, this one is quite meaningless for us because I do not do any uh, like multiplayer in Elden Ring, so I would not be using that uh, item. So this is where I came from, so maybe rest up a little bit, get our flasks back, and yeah, let's go fuck the boss up. Let's fuck up the boss. And I need some souls so that I can buy a stone sword key and come over here. There could be some interesting loot in there. Let's see what type of boss we have here. Maybe we are going to be too overpowered for him. Let's drink from the Flask of Wondrous Physic. Let's have our jellyfish. Cemetery Shade. Okay. Let's get this. Let's wreck the boss. Oh fuck. Fuck. No, motherfucker. What do I want to use? Oh. <laughs> That's nice. Lutel the headless. That's a new summon. Now let's go check this out. Summons the spirit of Lutel the Headless. Uh, legendary Ashen remains used to summon the spirit of Lutel the Headless, spirit of a headless knight who leads the mausoleum soldier, wield a lance, enrobed in death and hurls spectral lances at foes. Nice. Lutel sacrificed her life so that in death she could continue to protect a soulless demigod until their retrieve, uh, revival, earning her the hero's honor of our tree burial. Okay, so this is like a special spirit ash. And I think I'll be upgrading this. And in order to summon her, I need 104 mana. And I only have 84, so... Before I start using her, I need to upgrade my mind stat. Alright, good to know, good shit, good shit. Uh, what else we have here? Anything else? <laughs> this boss got wrecked so badly, like even like the jellyfish who was able to take him down. And my magic spells were like too much powerful for him. Anyhow. 
oh, there are some resin here. So why not I get this resin? Because it might come in handy for crafting some shit. All right, that's good enough. Got all the raisins that I need. Let's go back to entrance. Yeah, and another thing because I need some, I need to open that fog gate. I need some um, stone sword key. So I have about three thousand souls. I'll go to Kale and get some. I uh, get one like uh, stone sword key from him, if that helps. While I'm here, maybe how much souls do I have? Three thousand five hundred. If I can get like five hundred more, I can get like two. I don't need this. I'll just get rid of that. I don't need that as well, I don't do multiplayer. So maybe I'll use something more useful in this slot. What can I use actually? Let's see. Um, maybe I can use Uh, not really sure what can I use here. Hmm, there's so many things that I can choose from. Maybe I want to use... I really don't know what I want to use. Maybe I want to use... What are these? These are like explosive stone, break gem, use FP, produce a magic bolt. Okay, good to know. Gravity stone chunk. Gravitational explosion. Yeah, but these are not going to be something useful for me. I want to be able to use something useful. What can I have there? So maybe I should use the Wondrous Flask there. Because sometime I do use it. And what I will do is I will remove this from my item inventory here. I don't need this. Yeah, I'll keep the raw resin here. The less things that you can scroll through, the better it is, actually. Actually, over here, what I will do is I will keep the, the rainbow pebbles. Because they can come in handy. And... Well, this one is totally useless, though. What should I use it for? Maybe use it for... I don't know. Small red refugees and hostile sign to summoning pools. Create a summon sign for competitive multiplayer. I don't need any of this shit. So... I don't know. I'll just keep this empty for the time being. Or keep whatever I had there. Uh, let's not bother with it too much right now. I think I have everything well equipped right now. Oh no, I don't want to do that. Only there are no commoners remaining. Standard wear for commoners of land between a headband with cloth removed. With a cloth removed, okay. Maybe I can get something better. This one is better, but like... It gives us a little bit, like only one level, but it looks like shit. 
fashion souls is more important. Yeah, you know what? I'll just use this hood. This at least looks sweet. It doesn't look as silly as the red, um, <clears throat> the red uh, hood. All right, let's see. Can we strengthen any armament? The Uchi Katana, maybe. I don't have enough souls, not enough. Uh, well, I have enough souls, but not enough smithing stone. So anyhow, let's um, get a little bit more souls though, because we need to go back to the fog gate. So I need uh, 500. Okay, this should do. This should do. If I use all three, I should get 600. Ah, always. Purchase, stone sword key, come on, he does not sell any stone sword key, that's pretty useless, but I'm quite sure there was another merchant that was selling stone sword keys, now who was that, Kale you're totally useless, you can go and die. Maybe him? He has... no. He does not have any stone sword key with him. Who else had stone sword key? I don't remember anymore now. There was this nomadic merchant beside a fire. Maybe he has it? This is the castle Morn. We don't want to go there. We have taken care of that castle. So maybe this guy over here? I don't remember. I really don't remember. <laughs> Definitely not there. As you can clearly see. Wow, I can't find the merchant when I need one to buy a stone sword key. Not sorceress Selen. Maybe this one. You know what? Let's try. If we don't try, we will never know. Let's go. Yalla Habibi. Let's go and check what we have there. of you to stop by, please. Come on, no stone sword key. I clearly remember there was this guy who was selling like shitload of uh, stone sword keys. And I did not have enough soul back then, so I could not buy all of them. But now, I definitely cannot find any stone sword key. Well, let's go back to the map. It should be here somewhere. Maybe this fella over here has some stone sword key.
I don't want to go inside the cave. I want to get outside the cave. Oh no, I was actually in the right path. If I go outside of the cave... doesn't sell it either. What the fuck did he fuck? Who was it that was selling the stone sword key for two thousand dollars? Or like two thousand rules, not dollars obviously. That would be pretty expensive. Was there like a This merchant. Please tell me you have some stone sword key. I really should have bought all the stone sword uh, key when I saw them. Can tell how good my way. No stone sword key for me. I feel like killing you, you bastard. Why no stone sword key? You know what? Fuck you. You guys are pretty useless. What are you Fuck you, donkey. And fuck you, mister. How dare you trample us, you filthy thief. Nomadic Martians Ball Bearing 5. Nice. I can now go to the maiden and give it to her. The maiden husk. Let's go back. I think we wasted way too much time right now. Just trying to find a stone sword key. Uh, let's see. Table of Lost Grace. We should go over here, I believe. Oh yeah, that's where we need to go. No, not there. I need to go where the armor is, because the armor, I think, also sells some shit. So let's check the armor. Oh, well, I'm here. Do you have a spirit? Can I upgrade him? Yeah, I'm going to upgrade him, for sure. Well, I took you for no matter, it's all the same. Lay out your arms. I spoke with the girl. She has a gift for spirit tuning. So I told her everything I know. I'm indebted to a spirit tuner I met long ago. 
It was all I could do to honor her. I'm sorry I doubted you. Hmm. That's good. I really can't strengthen anything right now, right? I don't have anything that I can use right now, so let's go back to the maiden. But I was quite sure though, like there was this lady that was selling like stone sword key for two thousand dollars a pop. But I don't know like what happened to them. Like where exactly I saw it, but there was some place where they were selling two thousand dollars for a stone sword key. But whatever man. We gotta deal with what I what what hand we are given. These are like four thousand dollars each. Ouch. They're a little bit expensive. But what can I do? I need to get this. I have no other option. But I heard one thing though, maybe I can get some souls by doing that. If you jump off here you can actually fight someone let's see how does it work out in our favor let's try to do that yeah you need to jump from the balcony if i'm not mistaken into the thing there and this will open up a new fight for us and we only have a few amount of Shit. Oh my god. This guy is way out of my league right now. I don't think I should have been fucking with him. No, bad idea. I am not going to get my 4,000 souls from him at least. That's guaranteed. Can I get back at least the runes that I spent? Looks like no. I think I will have to do some farming to get some souls. Or can I? Do I have enough runes? Let's try. You selected, use all of them, yes. Oh, I might be a little bit short. Just a little bit. just need 800 souls more yeah I can't seem to remember where that other merchant was who can give me finger reader crone Maybe 
it was that guy that was selling like stone sword key for two thousand dollars or two thousand runes. Hey, now I can can I? You are still now talking. I can can I? Man, you are pretty useless. Maybe there. Ah, hello. Here to learn a battle. No, he definitely well. did not have anything on him. So I don't know where I'm making this shit up. Oh my god, can I get like 2,800 souls please, so that I don't need to like wander around like this crazy guy? Where can I get 800 souls? Seriously. Finger reader crone. Finger reader crone. All right. Am I stuck here? Fuck. Weeping ever gall. Hound ever gall. You know what? Let's take on this boss. I'll take on this boss. I think I can kill this boss because I'm somewhat powered. Once I take them out, then uh, yeah, I'll get some souls. Or maybe I can just <clears throat> kill these headless soldiers. Yeah, you know what? Let's not fuck with the boss. Let's just kill headless soldiers. They're the better ones to kill. Or die. Or you know what? I can actually fuck with the boss. You know what? Fuck it. I'll just go try to kill this boss. Maybe I can... Fuck you, boss. Enter Evergal. Let's drink from our wondrous flask. Fuck you, boss. Give me the soul. Why you jump back? Be the man. Be the fucking man. Holy fuck. 
Is that growing me? Fuck you, boss. Huh. Let's see how much soul that does he give us. Ragadon's Scar Seal. I wonder what that does. Well, we have enough souls to like buy maybe like two stone sword key. So, but I want to check out the item, what it does. Was that like a talisman that I got? What the fuck are they? Oh, here. Raises attributes, but also increases damage taken. Hmm. This is like a... Double-edged sword. I don't know if I want to use that. Let's see. Well, but I get higher hit points as well, so why not, right? I get higher stamina as well. Yeah, let's use this. Claw talisman enhances jump attack. Yeah, that's what I need. So you know what? I will uh, try to do my inventory management off screen. But in the next episode, I will see you in front of the fog gate in that dungeon that we did not take care of so bye for now see you in the next one bye